Now, there are reports at least 72 nursing homes and assisted living facilities in coastal Florida counties have been evacuated, including one that's in Flagler County. And that's where Kelly Wiley is joining us live with an update on the county's overall evacuation order. Kelly. Right now, I'm at Boonell Elementary, where their main population shelter is. They've got about close to 100 people in there right now. And there's another special needs shelter about eight minutes away at Rimfire Elementary. They have evacuated zones A, B, F, and any flood prone areas. And along with that, they're evacuating all of their nursing homes and all of their assisted living facilities. Hundreds of elderly patients in Flagler County are being loaded onto buses to flee Hurricane Dorian. At Tuscan Gardens Assisted Living in Palm Coast, many are comforting their elderly parents before a four-hour drive to their sister facility. We live right next door, and that's why they couldn't come with us, because we're mandatory evacuation also. Both of Debbie's parents have to leave town. She's doing okay. She's, she thinks it's an adventure. My dad's 93, so he's not so sure. Evacuation orders for nursing homes and assisted living facilities was the first phase of the county's evacuation plan. Now county officials are ordering people living in zone A, B, F, and flood prone areas to evacuate by 3 p.m. Tuesday. People like Peggy Lowry are choosing to stay at the county shelter. I've never been through anything like this before because I've, I've been living in New York all my life. Well, it's a little uneasy. You know, it's, it's not easy. You have to get up because I have to take my medication. I have to take something with food. June Bethel is also staying here with her granddaughter. She's had to evacuate for hurricanes before. Not to this magnitude, so we just have to pray that, you know, it'll go over us. So it won't be as bad as they're projecting. And right now we're here with Miss Jeannie. She came all the way from Ormond Beach. Tell me, how are you feeling being at the shelter? Well, I feel very safe right now. <laughs> I don't know what it's going to be, though, but I, I feel safe here. It's a very nice place. And you said you were waiting. You were hoping that Hurricane Dorian would shift and, and you didn't quite yes. see that. Uh -huh. Go to go out out to sea would help everybody, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You worried about back at home, your house? Oh, yes, I really am. That's the main thing because we, we feel very safe here, me and my dog and I. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that's kind of what everybody's saying here. They're just hoping that they have not a lot of damage to come back home to. Reporting live in Flagler County, Kelly Wiley, Channel 4, The Local Station.